And we are visiting the Sirigu Poetry and Art Center and we are currently going to see what's over there. We took a ride, we just got a driver, a friend and I, and it cost us about 150 CDs for the in and out trip, which I feel is very cool because it was quite a long trip. And I'm so excited about this place because this is traditional art and I learned that every pattern has a unique meaning. So let's go inside and then ask them more about it. Come along! SWOPA stands for Sirigu Women's Organization for Poetry and Art. So basically the lines on the wall are all artwork and they all have a different meaning in the local area. It was here that was 2002, so we put the statue there to remember him. And the painting you see on it, um, always we have this type on top, which stands for leadership. Leadership. Followed by this one. It's a local wooden net. Okay. For storing calabasas. There's one inside the calabas. So now this one. This is time for broken calabash. Broken calabash. So, does it have a meaning like yeah. broken calabash? Yeah, broken calabash. The woman, those are doing the portrait. Without the broken piece of the calabash, you can do a portrait. It's a tool they use for safeness also uh, for smoking. Okay. And this one, yes, that one stands for togetherness. I feel that together we need to have like this. Okay. Can you do the symbol again? Haha. -ha. So you see the hands that are there together. <laughs> That's the symbol for unity, guys. <laughs> While we were going on the tour, we saw some women dyeing some of the rafters the stocks for the baskets good afternoon Tuma Tuma <laughs> how long does it take to die it may take uh, 30 minutes or 45 minutes to die what, what do you use to die what chemical is it? It's just some cut that I'm doing. Uh, they are selling it. So, they yeah, have different, so many different types of colors. Yeah, it's orange. No. Orange. Orange. Mm. Yellow. Yellow. But the blue has finished. <laughs> yeah. This is the blue. Uh, oh, okay. Pink, pink or pink. Pink. Oh, okay. This is the blue. There is even a green one here. Then the one down there. Um, this one. This one we call it a Mizer What does it mean? A Mizer is someone's name. And it's in the heart. So. His the man and Mizer was a boss, no hair. Then uh, he used to play with the woman who was doing the painting. So one day, he was going to the market and he met some, some of the women on his way doing painting. So he passed by to make fun of them. <laughs> so when he got there, some of the women they were sitting down doing this particular thing. So he asked them, what is he trying to do on the wall? Sitting down, swagging. This one is to call me, so I will come and do it fast, fast for you, so I will go to the place together. So the woman turned 
and you said the face of the man and telling you're making a Oh, okay. Then you can also pass on it on top. Okay. Guys, let's see how the top. So guys, I'm on top of the roof or I am on the rooftop. I don't know how you people say it in this English. But if you want to spend the night looking at the stars in the upper east region in the town of Sirigu, be sure to come to Swopa. I would list down the prices again in the comment section. Sorry, I'm so out of breath. Be doing a lot of work in Charlie. But you will get mattresses, you will also get mosquito nets and everything. And I think this will be a unique experience to learn more about the local art. So this one has an air conditioning and then a small tv so please this how much does this room go for 100 cities okay for the two and the ones with the fan 65 so it's just like this but without the ac and the is what's the highest like what's the most expensive Guys, so if you want a cute artsy room like this, this goes for 100 CDs. So these are a few pots. We are currently inside the art gallery and we are going to be making one of these. Hopefully, I'm so excited. And then we are going into the art gallery. Lots of souvenirs here if you want to buy some. How much are these baskets? 100 CDs. 100 CDs. What do they normally use them for? For shopping. Oh, okay. For shopping, for aesthetics. Yeah. Oh, okay. So please, what do the animals also mean? Mm. Yeah, Is it because of Paga? <laughs> <laughs> or you have a special? <laughs> so whenever you see a crocodile in a painting, Savior, what's of the bucket? A little longer than a few minutes later. So guys, so... we're about to be making a pot. With one of the ladies in the sofa, it is. I'm really interested in how this turns out. Please, when I'm done, can I see the pot already? Yeah, it's going to be fine. It's a press. Will it be big? It's not. The broken, the old pot. The old broken pot. Yes. Okay. What's the sound? So, so when you get the new one, is the press clip. So you also have to get the powder from the old pot. Mm. So you can always mix it together. Okay. Then when you're about to use it, you spread the powder of the old pot on the floor. Okay. Then you can use the clay for easy timing and to also enclose the panel okay. okay. And these are the broken pieces of the calabash. That is the broken calabash. So as we were on the mat, we were waiting for the woman to treat the clay. I always played with clay, guys, because I grew up in Navongo and finding soil that was clay to make pots and pans or whatever our fingers could mold was second nature. However, this was no easy task. It got to a point 
my item i wouldn't even call it a vessel because it wasn't looking like a pot and it wasn't turning as easily as the woman's was however stella and i were both having fun the woman kept laughing we couldn't understand her language she couldn't understand ours but i think it was a very very beautiful communication look how smooth hers was guys so guys if you want a unique experience just know that whatever you do here will be something very different i mean we were struggling but we were also learning as well eventually i got a souvenir and to know that this is how it was made was so fun You hold it and be turning the pot itself. No, turn it uh, that way. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a comment, like this video, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. It really helps me. If you have any questions as usual, leave them in the comment section below and I will answer them as soon as possible. For now, it's bye and see you again.